welcome to the Bobby Mo Game Show. Let's play RMU Says. Holly Jolly Holiday Special. Here's your host with the most, Nathan Kingston. Hello, everybody. Ah, yes, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Bobby Mo Game Show, where we play RMU Says. Today, we have a very festive holiday Christmas uh, edition of our show and with me today I have two great teams over on our red side we have the Christmas Crusaders coming back for a third time let's see if they can get that streak moving along and over on our green side we have the stocking stuffers some first timers on the show let's see how they turn out today now uh, as for the Crusaders they have been on these past two Christmas episodes that we've had and they've taken home the W let's see if they can do that today against some young bucks over on the other side and if you don't know how the game works basically there is a question with a blank taken out of it and a bunch of half answers underneath of it and our contestants have to fill in that blank and in the first round here every correct answer is worth a hundred points so let's get right into it All right, starting off over here with the Christmas Crusaders for you guys. First off, Sam, how do you guys feel going into the, today's game? Feeling great. Feeling great. Yeah, we're unstoppable. Unstoppable. Mm -hmm. That's great to hear. Great to hear. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Your first question here in round one is, I love to blank in the snow. I love to blank in the snow. Our answers should be popping up here soon. There they are. I love to blank in the snow. Build a snowman. Build a snowman? Build a snowman is correct. Great answer there. Great answer. I always love to do that. Going over to Andrew. Andrew, how do you feel after uh, the past two wins? Feeling good. I mean, we're a veteran team. We're coming in with experience against a team that they're new. That's, a, that's an advantage for us. Very, very, very solid. <laughs> I also love the festive Christmas Thank sweater. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, same question for you here. I love to blank in the snow. No strikes here. I'm going to go with sled. Sled? Let me choose sled. Sled is yeah. correct. Sled is correct. Get on over here to Bella. Bella, first off, how are you? What are you doing for the holiday season? <laughs> I'm good. I'm going home. That's really all I got. That's all you got? <laughs> yeah. Did you get your uh, Christmas shopping done? Uh, yes, I did, actually. Oh, you man, you're, you're already ahead of me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, same question oh for you God. here. I love to blank in the <laughs> snow. I'm going to say ice skate. Ice skate. Yeah. Ice skate is correct. Yes, it is. All right, going over here, here to you. Cool, cool. I love how your shirt is a Christmas sweater, but it's not really a Christmas sweater. Yep. I love that. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, same question to you here. I love to blank in the snow. I'm going to say play in the snow. Play in the snow. Play in the snow is our number one answer there by our new students. All right, going back over to Sam. Sam, we got no strikes here. Got a couple answers left. I love to blank in the snow. Um, I'll say snowboard. Snowboard. Snowboard is correct. Yes, yes. All right, back to you, Andrew. I love to blank in the snow. I'm going to go with ski. Ski. Ski <laughs> is correct. No, wow. No. We have. We might have a clean sweep here. We'll come down to oh, Bella. No, All no. the pressure's on you. No, no not really. You I have. Don't know it. You still have three strikes left. Oh There's God. one answer. I love to blank in the snow. Share toys. <laughs> Let me see share toys. <laughs> no, it is not share toys. All right. Oh Going over here to you, Cole. There's one strike here, one answer left. I love to blank in the snow. I, um, I'm going to say uh, shake trees in the snow. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see shake trees. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not shake trees. All right, going back over to you here, Sam. Now all the pressure is now on you, Sam. I love to blank in the snow. There's one answer left, two strikes. The other team can't steal. <coughs> Not feeling great about it, but I'll say spend time. Spend time in the snow. It is not spend time. Going over to the Stockers <laughs> to see if they can steal this last answer. All right, guys. Let's see what you got here. What do we got? I love to blank in the snow. Any answer? Uh, we'll give you five more seconds here. I think that's a great answer. <laughs> uh, 
snow snow trekking. I don't know. Oh, if you can say that. Snow trucks. I don't know. <laughs> I love the snow <laughs> trucks in the snow. <laughs> she said that. <laughs> it's not so okay. trucks. Yeah. All right, audience, what, what do you got for me snow here? Snow tube. Snow tube. Can I see yeah. snow tube? Yes, it's snow tube. <laughs> That's a point for our audience there. Yeah. Those points actually don't matter. Anyway, we'll start off here with the first question for the stocking stuffers in round one. All right, I'll be starting off this time with Noah. Noah, how do you guys okay. feel after that first question <laughs> that the Christmas Crusaders got? Well, uh, I think that was fairly easy for them, but I, they did a really good job with it. We only had one tough one left. Uh, I wish we had some of the audience on our team because they seem to know it, but we didn't. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see if we can do better than that. I like it. I like it. I like it. All right, your question here in round one is, you may see a blank on a Christmas tree. Ooh. You may see, and that a uh, can be, uh, you can use it optional if you'd like. On a Christmas tree. Those are our answers right there. Noah, what do we got? I'm going to say so you're going to see some ornaments on that Christmas some tree. Some ornaments on that Christmas tree. Ooh. Yes, yeah, there better be some ornaments on that Christmas tree. All right, going over to Aaron. Aaron, uh, first off, what major are you here at RMU? Uh, sophomore engineering. Soft, oh, sophomore engineering. And what, yeah. what year are you? Oh, you're a freshman. All right, you guys all freshman on this yeah. side? Yes, sir. Oh, man, we really have a young buck team you guys are facing against. Time, they're <laughs> over the hill. We're, it's time to replace them for next year. <laughs> time to replace them. Oh, my goodness. All right, Aaron, your question here. You may see a blank on a Christmas tree. What do we got here? I'm going to go with a star. A star. Yeah. Yeah. Star is yeah. correct. Right. Number one answer there by yeah. RMU Are students. All right, going to go to Luke. Luke, your question is, you may see a blank on a Christmas tree. I'm going to say tinsel. Tinsel. Yes. Yes. Tinsel yes. is oh correct. Yeah. All right. Now we're here to you, Sam. We've got two Sams in today's game. Sam, yes. you may see a blank on a Christmas tree. Lights. Lights. Yes. Lights yeah. is correct. Yes, it better be some lights. All right. Back over to you here, Noah. You may see a blank on a Christmas tree. No strikes here, actually. So I know this is something that we like to do in my household. My mom always puts an angel at the top of the tree. Angel. <laughs> angel Ooh. is correct. Angel. All right, Aaron. You may see a blank on a Christmas tree. No strikes. Two answers left. I feel like that B might be bell. A bell. Is that? Yeah. All right. Bell. I like, I like it. <laughs> it is not bell. I don't know. All right. That is one strike know. for the stocking stuffers. Luke, you may see a blank on top on the Christmas tree. Two answers left, one strike. I really don't know. Uh, throw out any I answer. Guess, um, <laughs> a ball. <laughs> Let me see ball. <laughs> it is not ball. <laughs> we have the other team saying it was a good answer. I don't know. All right, over here to you, Sam. We got two strikes. We got two answers left. You may see a blank on a Christmas tree. Again, that uh is optional. Oh, okay. That doesn't help me. Can we help him or is it? No, you know, cannot help him here. <laughs> You're not supposed to ask the Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, gingerbread? <laughs> we'll go with gingerbread. <laughs> I, I think I it is not gingerbread. That is three hey, strikes for the stocking Ooh. stuffers. We're going over to the What's Christmas Crusaders oh. if they oh. can take this steal. All right, Sam. They what up, did not Nathan? get that done there, but you can you guys get this done here. You may see a blank on top of the – or on a Christmas tree, not on top. Garland. Garland. <laughs> Garland is correct. <laughs> All right, we're going to keep this steel moving here. Andrew, you may see a blank on a Christmas tree. I'm going to go with a bow. A bow. A bow <laughs> is <laughs> correct. <laughs> That was a clean steal by the Christmas Crusaders. And at the end of round one, we currently have the Christmas Crusaders at 800 points to the Stocking Stuffers at 600 points. And we'll be right back here for round two right after this. Thirty. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Skeeter, run down. One. Look at that. Take a look at us one time. Let's 
Feel the beat of nature at a park or forest near you. Find a forest and music inspired by nature at discovertheforest.org. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to RM Who Says. At the end of round one, we still have a very close game with our Christmas Crusaders at 800 points to our stocking stuffers at 600 points. But here in round two, every correct answer is worth 200 points now. So let's see what both teams can do. All right, starting off over here with the Christmas Crusaders, starting off with you, Andrew. Andrew, how do you guys feel after round one? Feeling pretty good. I mean, we've got a little bit of a lead to work with. We're, we're looking in a good spot. All right, I like to hear it. I like to hear it. All right, your first question here in round two is, I want to bake blank cookies for the holidays this year. <laughs> I want to bake blank cookies for the holiday season Whoa. this year. I'm going to go with gingerbread. Gingerbread. <laughs> gingerbread is correct. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's a great start. Bella, here we go. I wanted to bake blank cookies for the holidays this year. I'm going to go sugar. Sugar. <laughs> sugar is correct. Yeah. Number Say one answer. answer there. Number one answer there. Yes, a great answer. All right, cool. On to you. I want to bake blank cookies for the holidays this year. I'm going to say red velvet. Red oh. velvet. Wow, out of nowhere. Red velvet. Okay, cool. Okay. Back over here to you, Sam. Sam, I want to bake blank cookies for holidays this year. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. Peanut butter is correct. Yes. All right, Andrew. No strikes here. I want to bake blank cookies for the holidays this year. I'm going to go with chocolate chip. Chocolate chip. Classic. Yes, that's correct. All right. You have a kind of a clean sweep here without any strikes. Oh. Bella, Why I want to bake. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Bella. Because I don't know it. <laughs> I want to. <laughs> I love the honesty. I'm going to need an answer on this one. I want to bake blank cookies for the holidays this year. Oatmeal. Oatmeal. Oh. Oatmeal, <laughs> yes! Of course that's correct. <laughs> Thank you, what an answer. <laughs> All right, cool. No <laughs> strikes here. <laughs> <laughs> I want to bake chunk. blank cookies for the holidays this year. What do we got here, Cole? I'm going to say chocolate chunk. Chocolate <laughs> chunk? <laughs> no, it's not chocolate answer. chunk. That was a good chocolate idea. Chocolate chunk. Oh, my gosh. I can't speak today. I apologize. Anyway, Cinnamon. Sam, I want to bake blank cookies for the holidays this year. We have two <laughs> strikes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> One answer right. left. That'd be sick. Cinnamon cookie. <laughs> Cinnamon cookie. Cinnamon cookie. <laughs> 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 oh, that is oh. not correct. All right. I'll be going over to the <laughs> oh. stuffing stalker. What? Sorry, was that, what's that? Was that three strikes? All right, I will go back to you guys. I apologize. See, the problem is I don't know it. <laughs> All right, well, Andrew, you got this. Um, <laughs> I want to bake Blake cookies for the holidays this year. Uh, yeah. No. I got, no. I got nothing. You got nothing. I will I got nothing. say any answer. It's, it's cinnamon something, but I don't know what the other C is. Throw out a guess. I got nothing. We give you five more seconds to say <laughs> anything, <laughs> anything at all. Cinnamon chip. Cinnamon chip. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> it is not cinnamon chip. That is three strikes now. I apologize. <laughs> Going on over to the stocking stuffer, see if they can get this steal. <laughs> all right, guys. All right. You guys have a chance to steal <laughs> here. This is for some great points. I want to bake blank cookies for the holidays this year. Well, I know what we call them back home. We call them Christmas cutout cookies. <laughs> Christmas cutout cookies. <laughs> It is not Christmas cutout cookies. Audience, what do you think this is? Chocolate chunk? Chocolate chunk is not. It is chocolate crinkle? What? <laughs> that, hey, the only one you have to be mad at is RMU students. <laughs> anyway, we're going over to the stuffing, stu uh, stuffing stalkers if they can get this next question. All right, I'll be starting off this time with Aaron. Aaron. How do you guys feel after that really weird answer? Well, I feel great. You feel you just feel great. Yeah. Awesome. That is great. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's see if we get some points here. I'm going to use blank when making my gingerbread house. Aaron, what do we got here? I'm going to use blank when making my gingerbread house. I'm going to go icing. Icing? Yeah. 
You gotta have right that there, icing, right of there. course. Come on now. Right All right, Luke, over to you here. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. M and M's. M and M's. M and M's is correct. Yes. All right, over to you, Sam. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. House. Gingerbread. Gingerbread. <laughs> That's a good answer. Oh, no, apparently not <laughs> gingerbread. Man, that was a good That's a so he's selling. He's selling though. I would. I would have thought it was that one. I would have thought. All right, here to you, Noah. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. I'm going to be using them graham crackers. I'm going to use them graham crackers. Yes, yeah, some graham crackers, apparently. Yeah. All right, back to you, Aaron. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. Chocolate chips. Chocolate chips. Oh, guys, with you, that C is not that long. Oh, well, I had to say something. <laughs> hey, I, I got you. I completely understand. I completely like understand. All right, Luke, we got two strikes here. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. The other team can steal here. I, I don't know. <laughs> I, I love you guys' there. honesty. I think, <laughs> I think peanuts. I don't know why you'd use that. But <laughs> Show me peanuts. peanuts. Come on, let it be that. Thing. No, it's not oh. peanuts. That is three strikes going over here to the Christmas Crusaders to see if they can get this steal oh, moving. Yeah. All right, I'll be starting off this time, you know, with Bella this time on the steal. <laughs> All right. okay. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. I'm going to say candy canes. Candy canes. Yeah. Candy Woo! canes is correct. Yeah. All right, let's keep the steel moving, Cole. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. I'm going to say gumdrops. Gumdrops. Gumdrops is correct. All right, we got two answers left here, Sam. Let's keep the steel moving. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Peppermint? Peppermint. Peppermint, yes. Yes. All right, Andrew, we could have a clean steel here. I'm going to use blank when making a gingerbread house. One answer left on the steal. I'm thinking candy. I want to say Starburst, but that can't be it. <laughs> Starburst. Starburst. <laughs> it's not Starburst. I, Audience, what do you got for me here? Uh, Spinach. Skittles. What was that? Skittles. Spinach. Skittles. It's Robert none Ray. of those. It is sprinkles. Oh. <laughs> that was just dumb one of I don't make the rules. I just do the game. All right. And at the end of round two here, we currently have the... Christmas Crusaders at 2,600 points to our Stuffing Stuckers. St oh my gosh. <laughs> St <laughs> stocking Stuffers at 1,200 points. But it's still anyone's game here and going into round three right after this. When you adopt a shelter pet, you discover their unique mix of all kinds of traits. Where'd Wiley go? Where's Wiley? Ah, uh, there she is. Pa? Do you remember being an ancient wolf? Do you ever feel the call of the wild? You're a renegade cop, and I'm a con woman with nothing to prove. But together, we could really solve this murder. They're a little bit of a lot of things. But all of them are pure love. to RMU says we have a game here for you with currently going into round three we currently have the Christmas Crusaders at 2600 points to our stocking stuffers at 1200 points but don't worry it is still anyone's game here going into round three where every correct answer is worth 300 points so let's get right into it all right going over here to our Christmas Crusaders who currently have a huge lead right now starting off here with Bella Bella how do you guys feel after that second round Feeling really good, but don't want to get too cocky, you know? 
No, I completely understand. We got some questions coming up that are going to be the toughest ones we got so far. All right, starting off with your first question of round three is, Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. This is why I didn't really get Santa <laughs> might lose his blank in his ah. nightmares. What do we got here, Bella? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we got um, <laughs> Think so. Boots? Boots! <laughs> not what? boots, surprisingly. I would have guessed that as well. All right, Thank cool. Thank <laughs> <laughs> All right, Cole. Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. His presence. His presence. His presence uh, is yeah. correct. That'd be pretty scary. All right. Slay. Back to you, over to you, Sam. Sam. Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. Um, I will say reindeer. His reindeer. Reindeer <laughs> is correct. Great answer. Thank you. Uh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I, love, I love how polite everyone <laughs> is today. All right, over to you, Andrew. Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. I'm going to go with Toy Sack. Toy Sack. Oh. Toy oh, Sack is correct. Yes, yes, of course he would. <laughs> All right, back to Bella here. Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. His sleigh? His sleigh. Sleigh, of course it's <laughs> sleigh, of course. That's the number one answer there by RMU students. All right, back over to you, Cole. Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. No strikes here. Three might answers be left. Might be a stretch, but I'm going to say his beard. His beard. What? His beard yeah. is correct. Wow. All right, going back to Sam here. We got two answers left. Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. Cookies? His cookies in his nightmares. His cookies is correct. Oh, my goodness. We might have a clean sweep here. All right, Andrew. Santa might lose his blank in his nightmares. I'm going to go with coat. His coat. His coat yeah. is correct. Yeah. Oh my yeah. goodness, that is a full yeah. sweep there. Good oh my, answer. oh my gosh. Going over to our stocking stuffers for their question here in round three. All right, I'll be starting off this time with Luke. Oh, Luke, Luke, how do you guys feel after that uh, first start of round three? I don't know if it's even physically or mathematically possible for us to come back. I'm not really pretty sure that we're done, but hey, hey, hey. How many, ra how many back? rounds are there? Yeah, we, we might come back. We might have to see. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Your first question here in round three, Luke, is elves may have a smaller blank in their homes than people. Elves may have a smaller blank in their homes than people. Mm, I'm going to say toilet. A smaller toilet. Toilet oh. is correct. Number one answer there by RMU students. Yes, yes. All right, Sam. Elves may have a smaller blank in their homes than regular people. Doors. Doors. Oh, yeah. Yes. Doors is correct. It should be at least. There it is. There's door. All right, going over to Noah here. Noah, elves may have a smaller blank in their homes than people. I'm going to say they're going to have the small windows. Smaller windows. Ooh, okay. Let me see them windows. Ooh. Yes, smaller yeah. windows. Yeah, just, just <laughs> like those RMU season. windows. Yeah, yeah, yeah just like them RMU windows. windows. I got you, man. I got you. <laughs> All right, Aaron. Elves may have a smaller blank in their homes than people. I'm going with bed. A smaller bed. Yes, sir. That's on there. Smaller bed. Yeah, yeah that's on there. <laughs> you know it was. All right, Luke. Elves may have a smaller blank in their homes than people. Um, I don't know. I'm going to say couch. A oh, smaller yeah. couch. Yes, yes, a smaller couch. <laughs> All right, Sam. Elves may have a smaller blank than regular people. I'm going to say chairs. Smaller chairs. Ooh. Ooh. Smaller yeah. chairs is correct. Oh. All right, back to Noah here. We got no strikes. We got one answer left. Elves may have a smaller blank in their homes than people. I'm going to say, I don't know. It's got to be pretty a long answer, but <laughs> nothing's, ca nothing's coming to mind at the moment. So I'm just going to say uh, they're going to have a longer sofa. I mean, oh, yeah, yeah. They're, they're going to have a smaller sofa, sofa <laughs> even though couch is already up there. But <laughs> sofa. Uh, two different, <laughs> different things. Uh, All right, Aaron, one strike here. One answer left. Elves may have a smaller what than regular people? Hmm. Good question. It is a good <laughs> question. <laughs> 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 We're just throwing out guys at Star Wars. <laughs> it's not Star Wars. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Right. Honestly, I like that answer. <laughs> I, I, that was a great answer. All right, Luke. Elves may have a smaller what than regular people. Um, good boots. It's in there. 
I mean, if you look at all the other answers, Ooh. they're pretty normal. So, <laughs> and I yeah. hope that you would have one of these. Have one of these <laughs> in like my dorm? Possibly. Probably even. <laughs> That's the only hints I'll give you. With other people. Like we'll give you five them. more seconds. A room for them? Shower? <laughs> shower! Yes! yes. It's shower! No help was needed there. <laughs> All right. And at the end of round. What? <laughs> and at the end of round three, we currently have a final score of. Our Christmas Crusaders have the win here at 4,700 points to our 3,600 points of our stocking stuffers. But even though the game may be over, we do have a bonus round right after this. When I first saw Turtle, my heart was full. Not anything but lonely. We have this like deep connection, this heart connection. He just wants to be close to you and part of your life. Every day with Turtle is a perfect day. When I'm holding her, it makes me feel calmer. I think everything he does shows how much he loves us. When we adopt a shelter pet, we discover they're a little bit of a lot of things. But they're all pure, pure love. 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 If I could go back and change it all, I would. I would. I think I'm gonna miss you the most. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Or maybe it's just the little moments. I could go back. And I could go back and change it all. I could go back. I would. She had so many children, she didn't know what to do. She gave them some broth without any bread and kissed them all soundly and put them to bed. Hunger is a story we can end. End it at feedingamerica.org. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to RMU Says. At the end of, oh, yes, oh, yes, thank you. Thank you, studio audience, thank you. <laughs> yeah, thank you. At the end of three rounds, we currently had the Christmas Crusaders take the win, but thank you for tuning back in because we have the bonus round coming up. And basically how the bonus round works, each team will get a question back and forth, and the first question has one answer, second question has two answers, and so on and so on. So we're going to start the bonus round right here with the winning team, the Christmas Crusaders. All right. And as you can see, our Christmas Crusaders got a lovely mugs uh, for the winning w winning side there. Yes, yes, very. Y you guys get to add to your collection now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Your first question here in the bonus round is, I love to add blank to my hot cocoa. One answer here. Marshmallows. Marshmallows? It better be marshmallows. Yeah, it's marshmallows. <laughs> All right. Going over here to the stocking <laughs> stuffers for their bonus round question. This one has two answers now. Here, Noah. Oh, okay. Santa would invite blank to my Chris or to his Christmas party, I should say. Santa would invite blank to his Christmas party. Two answers. No, he's inviting Mrs. Claus. Oh, he better invite That's Mrs. Claus. Boss. Yeah, come on now. That's the boss. That's yeah, come boss. on. <laughs> All right, Aaron. Santa would invite blank to his Christmas party. One answer here. Yeah. Reindeer. <laughs> it's not reindeer. All right, all right, all right. Man. All right, wow. Luke. Santa would invite who to his Christmas party? Who would he invite? I'm thinking it's more specific than reindeer. I think it's Rudolph. I Rudolph. Yeah. Yeah. Rudolph yeah. is correct. Yes. Okay. All right, going over here to the Christmas yeah, Crusaders for the second question in the bonus round. All right, Andrew. There's three answers for this one. Besides yeah. Christmas, blank is celebrated this time of year. I'm going to go with Hanukkah. Hanukkah. Hanukkah is correct. Yes. All right. Bella, what else is celebrated at this time of year besides Christmas? Kwanzaa. Give me Kwanzaa. Give me Kwanzaa. There it is. All right. Cool. We got one answer here. Besides Christmas, blank is celebrated at this time of year. I'm going to say New Year's. New Year's. New Year's is correct. Man, they beat me to the punch on that one. Beat me to the punch that time. All right. You know what? That is our last question there in the bonus round, but I do want to ask, how do you guys feel after the third win? Any of you guys can answer. 
great. <laughs> feeling good. <laughs> feeling good? It was great. We defended okay. our title. Defend the title? We'll be back for there year four. Be on. back for year four <laughs> after. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> Thank you guys for coming on. I also want to thank our Stocking Stuffers team for coming on. I hope you guys can come on again for a second time. Hopefully you guys can be champions just like them. That is fair. Uh, and, uh, as, as for our Christmas episode, both our teams are coming home with something. And as always, thank you for tuning in to this week's RMU Says Christmas edition. Merry Christmas to everyone and have a good one.